All right, ladies and gentlemen, the Otaku Wolf is back once again to react, to amuse, and to share with all of you. Quick reminder before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and notification bell. You will find the link for the video used in this reaction in the description box, along with the links for my Patreon, my Webtoons, my Instagram. Please check them out. Appreciate it. And come and join the pack. All right. Um, well... Um, I have seen this before, but it's been so long, I figured, why not? So, I'm going to re-watch episode one of season two of The Villain's Lair. It's not over yet. Because, why not? Let's just go for it. I love that castle. Out in the dark, if you listen, you'll hear the sound of your fate as the ending draws near. It starts as a whisper, and soon it will grow. A warning that weaves through the wind as it blows. Yeah, now is that the. That sounds just like the voice from Frozen. Just a moment. Destiny calls something stirs from within. A game to be played, so now let it be. But yet the scale is a long way to fall. A sentence for life with no mercy at all. Like a story half untold. I think I preferred Jafar when he was in all black in the first season. <laughs> it's not. Ursula. Hmm. I grow tired of these games. The sea witch must be dealt with for the last time. Threaten me? I am a queen. I bow to no one. Ursula mentioned a deal. Perhaps we should discuss the terms. I have no intention of making another deal with her. What other option do we have? Only a direct descendant of a god can awaken the sundial's power. Precisely. Which is why we need to make a deal with her. The longer we wait, the more danger we put ourselves in. The sea witch is merely a descendant of a god. Mm -hmm. Perhaps then what we need is a god. I've been right here the whole time. Oh, get out of it. <laughs> Alas, the days when gods walked among us are long past. Perhaps. Mm -hmm. But there was one that walked below us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The Lord of the Underworld himself. Hades. <laughs> Isn't he dead? Like, dead, dead? You know as well as any of us, we've all cheated death. Yeah, this made so much sense. We may have shed our mortal coils, but our souls were never lost, allowing us to return. Yes, but Hades, his soul was devoured and lost to the river Styx. I say we fish his soul out of the river like a codfish. Perhaps a less primitive solution. Mm -hmm. There was once a king so cruel Oh, and man, I am just... I'm really no excited about this. Him, he was thrown alive <laughs> into a crucible of molten <laughs> iron. 
The hunt for ancient relics is exactly what placed us in this precarious situation to begin with. The Black Cauldron. Legend says its magic can return the dead. This may be our token to retrieve Hades. I must say, this sounds... Mm -hmm. Perhaps you should take a few moments to reconsider. The Black Cauldron is complex and unstable. It consumed the king who wielded it last. She's right. Now it lies lost in time. Its location shielded from the seekers of its powers. Mm. We shall see. Magic mirror, show thy face. Reveal the cauldron's resting place. Across the sea, the cauldron lies, hidden under more of the skies. Its power sleeps but never dies. The Lord once lost within shall rise. <laughs> We must go the Lord back. once lost within once shall rise. Uh, Perhaps he'll be inclined to repay the debt. Uh, a god indebted to us. The idea has merited. Oh, there's a callback. Sounds well enough, but I'm afraid a sacrifice was made that rendered the cauldron useless. And yet the mirror claims otherwise. Curious. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. Is it not the same mirror that named Snow White fairest of them all? Are we to believe that as well? Oh, ouch! We must leave at once! <laughs> yes! Time is running out, darling. Tick tock, tick tock. Please! Don't! Yeah, no. You've said nothing of the three witches who keep the cauldron well guarded. Oh. <laughs> the witches can be a nuisance and elusive. The only way to get what you desire is to bargain with them. True. I've got a bargain for them. Their lives for the cauldron. The witches have placed a powerful spell of protection upon their land. Apparently, some pig boy stumbled upon it. Ever since, they've been very guarded. No need for mm. magic. What we need is pirating! Yep. <clears throat> I'll sail there myself. And what of the witches when you arrive, dear captain? How do you intend to get past them and retrieve the cauldron? Exactly. A distraction, perhaps. What if they aren't in Morva at all? We could invite them here. <laughs> Offer them a bargain. We just need to entice them with something they can't resist wanting. The mirror. Mm -hmm. Sacrifice the mirror. Of course not, fool. The mirror is precisely the bait we need. I'll it's send true. It immediately. Um. They dare not refuse an audience with their queen. The cauldron will be left unguarded. Uh. A marvelous plan. <laughs> Do me good getting back on the high seas. Mm. That is one teeny tiny problem. You got no yes. ship. I have no ship. Mm -hmm. That blasted piece of pan took it. If you can get me a ship, me crew and I will get you that cursed cauldron. I believe I may have the solution to that particular obstacle. Hmm. A prince arrived on a magnificent vessel only yesterday. A worthy suit of one of my two daughters. Poor devil. What was that? His name is Prince Hans Westergaard of the Southern Isle. He's also a captain. Perhaps he can be motivated into a joint venture. Hmm. Ah, my dear. Yep. I Enter Hans. Motivation cooperation it's settled then i'll send for the witches of morva here for a party <laughs> that's marvelous i'll get to it Corella, you you're already in enough trouble as it is social event of the season let me help darlings i think we've had all the help we require yeah. from you and i'll go in case you need some extra muscle I shall accompany the captain to Morva. I have no intention of leaving our fate in the hands of an imbecile. A crew of pitiful lackeys or a traitorous furrier. Me? Mm. <laughs> Darling, you can't be serious. I've simply no time.
time for recruits, although I absolutely adore them. You kept knowledge of our enemies' whereabouts from us for punishable events. Think of it as your penance. You're welcome to stay. It is I'm your sure. fault that I'm Ursula sure. has the dial. <laughs> when do we leave, darlings? <laughs> what of the sea witch? She has command over wind and sea. There is another wind coming that will sweep away her pride. Like a story half untold, like a secret to unfold. Waiting in the shadows, the hunt hard for prey. Like a battle just begun, when it's neither lost nor won. Hanging in the balance as time slips away. Watching, waiting, anticipating, like a sun about to set in. <laughs> Just a minor note here. Valmira said the Lord once lost within shall rise. But did not say was talking about Hades. And we all know there's more than one Lord. Or locked in that thing. Could it be that instead of Hades, they'll be summoning the Horned King back to the land of the living? Mm. I guess we'll find out. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already subscribed. Leave your comments down below and I will see you at my next reaction. I love you all and there is nothing you can do about it. Until we meet again, adieu.